Okay, this is the 2021 KTM 250 SXF. As you can see, this is the Troy Lee design version. And I'm just gonna go over some special parts that it has compared to the baseline model of the KTM. Starting off, new to this year actually, the new KTM MyRide. Basically, it's kind of like a mapping computer. Bluetooth connects to your phone, kind of like the Yamaha versions, but this version actually replaces your bar pad. It comes with a anodized orange triple clamp by KTM Racing. And it also has the WP exact forks. It's the same as the baseline model. Coming down, as you can see, the brake rotors are actually floating. They are not oversized, They're same same size, but they are floating. Um, also, they have a pair of DID Dirt Star um, rims. It's not gloss, it's matte, with orange nipples, black spokes, and an anodized orange hub. This bike is also equipped with an Akaprovic um, titanium silencer just to slip on. And as you can see, we removed the inside uh, restriction, sound regulations, and all that. That is actually an option. You just take that out. A little rubber. It's basically the same, the, the hoops is the same as the front. This one is actually equipped with a black sprocket. Um, and the brakes, the rear brakes continue being the same as the factory KTM, the baseline model. Another special thing about this bike, it's mainly just for the looks, doesn't really improve anything, but it is equipped with the 2021 Troy Lee Designs graphic kit has that nice yellow and purple, really gives it a kick. And this year, the baseline models came with the black frame, and only this bike came with an orange frame, powder coated, like kind of like the 2018 ones. Um, this bike also comes with a composite um, skid plate, and also comes with a Hinson clutch cover not the clutch, just the clutch cover. Another thing to add a little bit more of airflow, some more airflow. This bike comes with both actually, the closed off one and the one with holes. As you can see, this one does not have that part. It's open and it has all these holes for more airflow. Side by side comparison of both of them. As you can see, they trimmed off some of this plastic that comes on. More airflow right here and also over on this side. The closed off one has this big lip that covers, restricts airflow. This one they got rid of it, and of course the, the holes that one. Here's the bike with the closed off airbox cover. As you can see, it is closed off, but not 100%. You still have a little bit of space for air to get in. This is definitely preferred on wet, drip, wet days, and the uh, Increased airflow one is definitely better on dry days because you definitely don't want so much sand getting in there. This bike also comes with the whole shot device. It does not come equipped with this whole shot device. Um, you have to put that on personally. It goes on your front right fork and fork cover. Some things that come with the bike separately. You have the fork pump. See, so you could let's check your air forks. Inside it comes with an empty notebook. This is just so you can write your notes down. All right, uh, it comes with a spacer just in case you wanna take the front discard off because that one is a piece and a mount. 
So that comes also with the throttle and some other things. The spoke tensioner, extra bolts, and basically, oh, it comes with the, I love these pens. It comes with a little KTM pen. And that's basically it that comes with.